Hey everyone, welcome to Holy Cross. Um, there's a lot been going on in the building and we wanted to kind of give you a little sneak peek of what some of the renovations look like and some of the progress that's been made. So this is the former Godly Playroom. Um, it, we've got a carpet. This will be uh, when we get some type of assistant or uh, interim pastor. They would be using this space, but it can be used for some circles at some point. Uh, hopefully, you know, this room will be utilized. They've changed a lot, <laughs> you can tell. That used to be straight ahead. This is going to be the treasure counting room space. So they'll have this designated to them to use. So one thing goes in there. Exciting. We'll head down the hallway, which are going to be used as our children slash teen young adult ministry rooms but will be this, used i'm going to jump this. in this is all <laughs> stuff that needs to be relocated yeah. that was in the godly play closet yeah. whoever has a video about that the rooms will be used for various groups during the week as well so and this is the hallway that used to be there used to be the resource room and the counting room over here and this is now the large space for us to use for uh, to store things, Christmas, all of the things that are miscellaneous resource stuff, crafts, things that used to be in the resource room. It smells like carpet in here. <laughs> this will be the new Godly Playroom. all the cabinets, kids hang out on the floor, um, being able to tell stories, and allow us to have some space of our own. This is going to be the kids kingdom, so this will be ages probably fifth through, I'm oh, sorry, third or fourth through fifth, sixth grade. Um, we'll also use this probably during our 612 time for the middle schoolers. So you can see this is a pretty large room. Hoping to have some tables, some nice comfy stuff to hang out in, um, obviously some shelving, things like that. So, And like I said, various groups will be able to use these throughout the week. And last but not least will be the kind of 612 teenager group room, which is also very large. Um, we're hoping to, to do some things. There's still some talk about cabinets and countertops and things like that, but we will be keeping that space. So picture some couches, like I said, comfy stuff, tables, areas for them to work on things in here, um, and hopefully liven it up quite a bit so that we can you know, make it our own and they can express themselves in this space. So, um, I think that's all. Hope you enjoy the tour. Uh, hopefully we'll see each other in person soon uh, and have a great day.